In this tutorial, you will learn how to create a road model with the road wizard using reference data. This tool makes it easy to convert files with line information into road data in the field. In this exercise, we want to reconstruct a state road. We open the roading application. We have loaded a DXF file, which is the road design. To use it in the roading application, we must convert it into a road model. From the toolbox, we select the tool Create Road. A wizard opens. On the first step, we define the center line by selecting the middle line of the loaded reference file. Optionally, we can apply a start stationing and flip the start and end points of the line. We can also clear the settings by using the eraser button. We set stationing of 1200 meters. In the next step, we select the reference file containing the road lines to define the road model. We can also use the map button in the bottom bar to select the file from the map. We continue to the next step. This step is optional and needed if the road design has no or wrong heights. We can perform a vertical transformation of the model to the design surface. In this exercise, the heights in the DXF file are correct, so we can skip this step. We tap on OK and give the file a name. It saves the road model as an LMD file. Back on the map, we open the layer manager, turn off the reference file, and see the new road model. Let us now create a center line without road lines. We start the wizard again. In the first step of the wizard, we use the layer manager to turn off the previously created road model and turn on the reference file. We select the middle line. We apply the same stationing, so the road line starts again after 1200 meters. No more information from the second and third wizard step is needed, so we can skip them. We tap on OK in the last wizard step. We give the road line a name, and tap on OK. It is stored as an L3D file. Using the layer manager, we turn off the reference file and see the newly created road line on the map. We go to export and find the created road model and road line in a separate box labeled Road Data. We select both files and export them to a USB stick so other construction surveyors and machine operators can use them. That's it. You have learned how to create road models and road lines based on reference data. Now you can use it in the roading application and provide it to machine operators.